Welcome to Look Smarter Than You Are with the S-Base Calc Scripts, the alias function. The alias function returns an alias name to the calling function from the default alias table. To use the alias function, we enter in alias followed by a string parameter. The string parameter is a text value that equates to a member name in the outline. We use the alias function to pass member alias names as strings. For example, when passing alias names as strings to functions such as isUDA, UDA concatenate, substring, match, or name. Some of these functions that accept strings as arguments may not function correctly if the string matches a member alias. Sbase may interpret the member alias as the member instead of a text input. So for example, if the value US dollars is both an alias and a user defined attribute, we need to pass the string using the alias command. To do that, we can use if is UDA alias US dollar. That way our US dollar alias gets passed as a text input to the is UDA function. For another example, let's say we want to set the population measure to 100 if the alias of our member is Azkaban. So for this, we have a prisons dimension with our aliases assigned to each member. So we have Leavenworth, Alcatraz, Azkaban, and Morton Hall. So if the alias of our current member of the prison's dimension is equal to Azkaban, population equals 100. The alias function only matches on the default alias table. If you have multiple alias tables in your S-space outline, the alias function will only return the value from the default alias table, unfortunately. 